Yep. Well, ladies and gents, on TV here, it's another vlog, as you can see. I tried to turn on my 3DS, and I charged it last night. Because, I don't know, I did that. And, yeah, that was on a full charge, and it lasted for, like, what, 30 seconds before I, before it died? Yeah, there's something wrong with my 3DS. Actually, if you can see here, like, this part here is a bit warped. It's, like, curved. And on this side, it's not, so. Like, either the battery on my 3DS is just dead and can't hold a charge. Like, it needs to be plugged into the charger, or else it will actually die. Or maybe it's slightly disconnected. I don't know, but I don't have, like... I don't have a screwdriver that would actually like be able to pry this thing open, so yeah, it's it's this 3DS is a bit old now. I mean, I got this like a little after Christmas of 2011, so I got this like around 2012. So it's this thing is four years old. Yeah, it's kind of unfortunate, really, because this is such a cool 3DS. I mean, it's like the little Ocarina of Time bonus one. But, yeah. Like, eventually, like, maybe I'll pry this thing open and see if, like, something's up with the battery. Maybe get it replaced. Because it might be slightly disconnected. Just I have no way of knowing. But, uh, yeah. Either way, I definitely need to upgrade, so. Let's go to GameStop. Okay, GameStop, it's kind of blocked out by the cart holder thing, but, um, funny story, actually. I was halfway to GameStop, it's not that far of a drive, like, five minutes to get to GameStop from where I live. But, like, halfway through, more than halfway through, actually, I was, like, right at the intersection behind this building. But, like, I was right there, I was like, wait a minute, I forgot my wallet. Which isn't good, because my wallet has things like my license and my card. And other important things, like my Burger King gift card, that's probably, like, has two cents on it, but, yeah. But, um, I had to drive home and get it, so, yeah. But, let's go pick a thing up. Okay, so I'm home now, and here it is. I got myself a new 3DS XL. A red one, actually. One reason why I got a red one is just because... I mean, the black one is, it just seems boring to me because everyone gets, like, the black new 3DS or whatever. And, actually, um, I have new, uh, the new 3DS version of Xenoblade, and because the Monado is red, I wanted a red one. Stupid reasons like that, but, yeah. It's, it's definitely a thing that I upgraded because, as I showed before, that old 3DS there is pretty much on life support right now. And also, like, I've just been meaning to upgrade anyways. So, yeah. So, um, let's crack this thing open. Okay, so right off the bat, here's everything. There's the instruction manual and some AR cards, which I never really made use of. And here's the actual system itself. Don't mind the mess on my bed. Cool. Looks pretty nice. Now, I've never had, like, an XL system. Like, um, like, Jamie and Anthony, they both have the regular 3DS XL, and Matt has a new 3DS XL, which I've played before, but, like, I've never had one for myself. Like, even with the DSi, I never had a DSi. I just had, like, the regular DS over there. I, there's two of them over there. So I've never had, like, an XL system, so, yeah. I've tried them out, though, because, like, I've played, like, on my friend's handhelds and it's interesting i mean it's something i'm definitely going to be needing to get used to but um here it is i'm definitely going to need to charge this i still don't know why the new 3ds xls don't come with chargers but i have one plugged over there for thing so you know what i'm gonna have to i'm gonna charge this so i'll see you guys in a bit but this does look really nice I do like how it's like curved on the edges there. Makes it look pretty sleek, I guess. I'm also gonna need to get some screen protectors for this, but that's for later. Well, this sucks. So apparently uh, Nintendo's doing some server maintenance right now because 
the reason I'm talking about this is because um, I was going to do a system transfer from my old 3DS to the new one, and yeah, it's not, can't really do that right now because it's under maintenance. Right here, it's like the eShop server is under maintenance, so I assume that's what's causing it to be a thing, because uh, above here, like, Currently, all servers are operating normally, according to this. But, no. This one's under maintenance, and so is the one for the DSi eShop. But, uh, yeah. So, hopefully it doesn't last that long. Because I kind of want to transfer all my stuff so I can actually play a thing. But, whatever. I'll wait a little bit. I'll wait a few hours, I guess. But if not, then... I don't know. But, uh, yeah. That's kind of unfortunate, really, but whatever. So I made a little miscalculation here when it came to transferring everything. Mm, yeah. The SD card. The SD card on this 3DS is 8 gigs, and the micro SD card on this one is 4. So I can't copy everything just yet. Like, I'm almost done. So, yeah. And also, the system transfer was a very, very tedious process because the internet kept dropping out, all that stupid stuff, and there was like an error at some point. But, um,. Yeah. You know what? Might as well play a game on this thing before I end off this vlog. So, yeah, let's let's do that. I'm happy. But I'll end it off here so I can play. Later. Also, I'm wearing my Xenoblade shirt. <laughs> yeah, later.